Hi, do you guys ever remember being super excited as a kid because a celebrity had the same birthday as you? Natalie, guess who else's birthday it is today? Who? It's J-Lo's birthday. What? Yeah. You share the same birthday oh, as J-Lo. That is crazy because, you know, I kind of look like J-Lo. Well... Yeah, it was worth a shot. But I remember as a kid telling everybody like I was proud of it or something. Up next on E! News, J-Lo's latest music video. Do you know that J-Lo and I shared the same birthday? I told you that. That's a cool song. You know, J-Lo and I shared the same birthday. That wasn't a J-Lo song. Yeah I, yeah, I know, but it's like music related and stuff. Like, well, you know, J-Lo and I have the same birthday. Nat, you told my mum this was an emergency phone call about homework. I thought we were friends. I guess I kind of felt that because we were born on the same day, even though it was decades apart in different places in the world, it meant that J-Lo and I, we, we shared a special bond. Oh, my first job interview. I'm so scared. What would you do, J-Lo? How am I meant to know? I'm just a picture. But you need a better printer. Well, that was mean. I mean, we have the same birthday. Might as well be sisters. Well, you know, I never had a picture up on my wall. But you know what I'm saying? It's one of those weird things that kids do. And the reason I thought about this was because the other day it was my birthday and I realized that I'm getting older because I no longer open presents like this. Hiya! Now that I'm boring and older, something weird has happened where I get sad when I see nice wrapping paper and I'm really precious about opening it. Don't want to rip it. And seriously, I just keep it. Like I collect wrapping paper. I'm like a serial killer collecting skins. I should probably get rid of it, but it feels so nice. You know, and as I get older as well, I really appreciate practical, boring gifts. Thank you so much. I actually needed underwear. All my old underwear has holes in it. I don't know why. It's like I don't have anything sharp down there. But then again, I've never been brave enough to look. And on that highly disturbing note, let me know if you've ever, you know, looked up which celebrity you share a birthday with. And if you know, let me know who you share a birthday with. I'd love to know. And thank you guys so much for your beautiful birthday messages. It feels so nice. It does feel so nice. And I hope you guys have a nice weekend. I will see you in a week. Bye. Okay, it's porno music slash comment time and Nutmeg Harrison, I would never have thought you were implying anything sexual when you suggested to stay with the child, but thank you for clarifying that. And there was an overwhelming amount of suggestions to use fake monster repellent. I want to know, does this actually work? How weak are kids these days if they're satisfied with this? Because I wouldn't be. I'd want bullets. I want to see eyes roll into the back of heads. And you know, the sad thing is, I only learned how to make a GIF last year, about the same time I learned what Tumblr was. Yes. I is the internet.